So it's telling Tim Brian that as I was going through the traditional civil wedding ceremony act of the Norfolk Territory, so it's quite a few things that I had to do. All of the legal stuff we had to were waiting on. So it should be a pretty quick, pretty quick ceremony. We should be out of here in no time. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this very special occasion. We are here today to witness the marriage of Brianne Scheel and Tim Walterhouse, uh, according to their wishes. Marriage represents the decision of two people to share their lives, to commit their love and trust to each other. Brianne and Tim have decided to give themselves to the other to make them both, as a couple, better and stronger. Marriage results from the love that two people have for each other. It is a state of sharing, of consideration, and of respect. Marriage is a commitment that results in both partners attaining a greater appreciation for life by the simple fact of sharing their lives. Brian and Tim have chosen to commit to each other in the state of marriage. They desire a life of companionship in which they will share, help, comfort, and love one another. Marriage is both a joyous and serious commitment. Therefore, uh, if anyone present knows the reason why Brian and Tim may not be married, speak up now. <laughs> Brad and Tim, if either of you know a reason why you may not marry, you must declare. Um, Brad and Tim, uh, there being no reason why you may not be joined in marriage, I will now ask you to express your commitment to each other through your marriage vows. Brad, there you go. <laughs> you give yourself to Tim to be his partner in life, to love him, comfort him, respect him, and protect him with patience and understanding, to share um, to share with him your life, to care for him always in sickness and health as long as you are able. Tim, do you give yourself to Brienne, to, to Brienne to be her partner in life, to love her, to comfort her, to respect her uh, with patience and understanding, to share with her your life, to care for her always in sickness and in health as long as you are able. And you have rings. Grant <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, and Tim, you have shared your promises to one another in our presence. Uh, Brian, will you give your ring to Tim and repeat after me? With this ring, I be with. Tim, <laughs> will you give your ring to Brienne and repeat after me? With this ring, I be with. With this ring, I be with. And now, as you, Brienne, and Tim have consented to be married and have declared your solemn intention before those gathered here today and in my presence, you have now accepted and committed to each other. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Go ahead and clap. As you enter upon your marriage, let your home be one of peace and love for each other. Let your relationship be one of understanding and respect for each other. And consider that as the world gives nothing freely, neither will your marriage yield more than you can than you give into it. May you enjoy many happy years together, and may your lives be filled with hope and contentment as long as you live each day, enjoying and appreciating the commitment you have made to one another before us here today. I ask you to symbolize your commitment to each other with a kiss. Tim, you may kiss your bride. Thank <laughs> you. 